glacier gains mass through accumulation, which is the build-up of layers of snow which can arrive at the glacier directly through deposition or wind and or avalanche transport. Once this snow is deposited onto the glacier, it is transported down valley into the ablation area. Here, mass loss occurs through melting, evaporation and iceberg carving. The point on a glacier where accumulation and ablation are equal is known as the equilibrium line. Above the equilibrium line, accumulation is greater than ablation, and this is known as the accumulation zone. Below the equilibrium line, accumulation is less than ablation, and this is called the ablation zone. Both accumulation and ablation are controlled by climate. During colder climates, accumulation exceeds ablation and the mass balance of the glacier is considered positive. The equilibrium line shifts downwards and the glacier grows. Conversely, during warmer climates, ablation is often greater than accumulation. The mass balance of the glacier is negative and so the equilibrium line shifts up and the glacier shrinks. And that was Glacier Mass Balance in a Minute.